Hello and welcome to Next Day Solar. We're here in North London and we're going to be installing this property 11 panels and 445 Jinkos and we're going to also be installing a Fox hybrid inverter 5 kilowatt and also we're going to be installing a 9.6 kilowatt battery storage. The particularity of this property is that we're going to have a backup system because there is a pump here and a drainage uh, water pump and uh, that pump needs a backup system so uh, let's go and uh, check that. is the consumer unit of the property which has the main loads and this consumer unit that we fitted which has the backup loads and the chain manual changeover switch and here what we have is the inverter it's a five kilowatt inverter from fox so it's able to take five kilowatt of the load of the property and here we have uh, two 4.8 kilowatt batteries from fox they are the energy cube and in this uh, property on the roof we have an 11 uh, Jinko and uh, 445's uh, panel and this property has a backup system and the reason why is it has a uh, water drainage system that relies on the backup and it has its own backup but it will only last for about two hours so what we did is we gave it much uh, longer life uh, with this uh, 9.2 kilowatt battery storage and it should last for uh, a day. This is the grid. This is the main grid. Yeah. So if you do this, the inverter recognizes it and those goes immediately to EPS mode, emergency power supply mode. Okay. Immediately now you can see that it went to EPS mode. And then again here, you change from how, mains. How come the, the light is still on? Because I haven't, I haven't, I just stopped it at the inverter level, not at the house level. Now I'm gonna do at the house level, we're gonna lose light here, but we shouldn't lose any, like for example, kitchen socket, upstairs uh, sockets, SPD. Yeah, we got everything working here. Uh, sockets in here work, and the, the light. Sockets work? Yes. The kettle, you could turn it up? Yeah, work. Yeah? Um, the socket works. Mm -hmm. You see the study. In case of a grid failure, so we came here to do a grid failure uh, simulation test and we've gone up upstairs and now uh, the customer have seen that a few of the sockets that were um, intended for a backup uh, emergency uh, supply were on. For example, the pump was on, the lights were on, the boiler is on, the up upstairs socket is on, the kitchen socket is on. Do you will also find here that there is one socket that is uh, designed specifically for the backup initially installed by the installer of the pump which is this small battery EPS system. So if you're having a similar request or uh, need a solar uh, panel with a battery installation please don't hesitate us to contact us at hello at nextdaysolar.co.uk Thank you very much for watching the video and see you on the next one.